The biggest misconception about our work is that farmers, particularly very poor farmers, don't have any money to save and that they only need credit or grants. But if you go to any village in rural Africa, you'll see stores selling tea, sugar, even Coca-Cola. People have money. It's just that it's in small increments. My name's Anushka Ratnayaka. I'm the CEO and founder of Myagro. Most farmers, smallholder farmers, actually go hungry at some point during the year because they don't grow enough to eat. In the countries that we work in, 70% of the population are smallholder farmers. So if now this population is no longer poor, no longer experiencing food insecurity, that'll have a massive impact on the entire country. We actually believe that farmers have money in their own pockets. It's just that it's in very small increments throughout the year. And so our solution is to help farmers save small amounts of money throughout the year so they can afford to buy the seeds and small amounts of fertilizer they need at planting time. And when we think about farmers is we think about them as one big block, but actually they're female farmers and male farmers and how they approach their farming is really different. We use a gender lens in everything that we do so that we can specifically understand the motivators and barriers for women to join our work. To date, we've served over 100,000 farmers they've doubled the amount of food that they've grown each year. Last year, that translated to nearly $200 of additional net income. And for the average farmer who's living on $1.50 per day, that's a 35% increase in income. So those are all the numbers, but for an individual family, what this means is more girls in school, more food on the table, better housing, and that has real impact for not only the farmers, but their children as well.